Private Wind James here, back with another look inside the box review. This time it's the Special Hobby 172nd scale Harvard Mark II 2A and 2B variants, the British Commonwealth Air Training Plan. The kit contains the Academy 86G Texan, that's what the Americans called it, and the British called it the Harvard. The Texan plastic parts with new injected slash resin and photo etch conversion parts also. So on the the front of the box is the five decal scheme you could do. It's again just the, the name of it and what it contains. Same around So in the box, I've opened it already to have a look, in one bag contains the plastic parts, in a separate bag within that is the decals, and again another separate bag, the canopy, another separate bag is the resin parts. And you can lastly the instructions, the, the decal and the paint scheme options in the back. Taking a look at the plastic first, you get another option for the canopy fully open. You get two, you get three plastic screw parts for the aircraft. First sprue spray sheets, you get the fuselage halves, the rear control surfaces, some interior parts, it's the prop, the engine and the cowling. Now this is a close up for screw 8. You get the recess panel lines, there is rivet detail also, it's fine, it's free from flash, parts are clear and crisp. Lines are defined. The fuselage halves inside, there's no detail as you add separate parts for the detail. Just moving on, this is B, you get the, the two upper wing halves, the landing gear oleos, some other detail, vents, the instrument panel, rear tail wheel. Lastly, spruce C is the lower length one piece uh, lower wing. You have the interior seats, a spinner, various aerials, you have the wheels, and then the, the main pilot's instrument panel.
next is the, the two options for canopies. You have the full open one, and there's the closed one. The, the framing is raised so you could again mask yourself or buy masks. Next to the resin you get two interior control levers, the exhaust for the different option of Harvard, a pitot tube and I guess something to do with the landing gear. Next are the decals and photo etch. Uh, they're in good register, the colours are good. There is, when I peeled the paper off, as you can see, there's this texture, which is a shame, all over the decals. Photo etch. Lastly, the instructions. The front, you get a side profile of the Harvard. You have Czech Republic and English text uh, giving a brief history of the aircraft. Opening up the first page you have the sprue tree map so if you can't find a part you just can come to here refer to it it tells you the uh, photo etch you have the canopies the resin parts also there's also uh, suggested colours symbols uh, throughout the instructions telling you if you need to bend the photo etch glue options uh, scratch building if required and cutting and filing uh, away plastic parts then steps one through to four is the aircraft's interior for the pilots Over the page, uh, five to seven is working on the uh, the engine and the props, gluing the two upper and lower wing halves together, and then gluing the wing halves and the rear control services and canopies to whichever one you want to do, open or closed, to the fuselage and then the wings and the engine also gluing to the fuselage. Uh, eight and nine is adding the landing lights, the pitot tubes, there's two options, uh, a short one or a long one. I guess the, the main, the rear and the foresight for the weapons, if there is any added to your option. Nine is the landing gear and exhaust to whichever one you add. So that was nine build steps all together and over the page you have uh, the five decal options and paint schemes.
and on the back you have suggested kits in their range or so. So that's the Special Hobby 170 second scale Harvard Mark II, 2A and 2B the British Commonwealth Air Training Plan kit. Thanks for watching.